Hello everyone, hello, I am Patrick Macias. And I'm U.S. Agawa. And this is our weekly web show, Otaku mm -hmm. vs. Zero, huh? where we cover uh, stuff from Japan, mm -hmm. anime, manga, games, otaku <laughs> stuff, real Japanese culture, for example, uh, cards, blinged out, cards. picked out, if you will, wow. with anime characters <laughs> called Itasha. Uh -huh. Okay, and today we are reporting live from the war zone known as Ita G Festa. Yeah. This is the fourth such event held in uh, Odaiba here in Tokyo. And there are over a thousand vehicles, uh, cars, uh, motorcycles, bicycles, all decorated with anime characters. And uh, it's not just an exhibition, it's a competition, meaning prizes will be given away for the best in show. So it is indeed a quest for excellence. Mm -hmm. So uh, a brief word about uh, Itasha. Uh, let me see if I get this all right. The word comes from originally the 1980s, mm. when the Japanese economy was very strong and you had a lot of money and everyone <laughs> here was rich and eating uh -huh. caviar. People were really big into Italian cars. And I guess uh -huh. you guys abbreviated that as uh -huh. What, Ita for like Italian, uh -huh. and uh, Sha for like Densha, uh -huh. and then made a new word called Ita Sha. Mm -hmm. But then as otaku culture got more, shall we say, advanced <laughs> and uh, complicated, uh -huh. I guess the Ita became uh, Ita for pain, painful. So I guess um, now we can call these Ita Sha, that means painful cars, painmobiles. <laughs> Painful in the sense that they cost a lot of money to maintain and to uh -huh. make your car look as gorgeous as this panning and stocking mobile. But uh, also, uh, they're kind of, they can be kind of embarrassing, I think. I don't know, how do you feel? How would you feel like sporting around town in one of these? Uh, just, just looking and watching yeah. is okay, but I, it's difficult to get on inside of them. Okay, well, that's too bad because today's the day uh -huh. you're going to get inside of each other. Yeah! Yes, it's going to happen. Uh, it's going to be recorded for posterity for millions of people to see, hopefully. And uh, now we're going to run around and look at each other. So let's go. Let's go this way. Okay. Shall we? This is kind of amazing right here. We've got a, a Vocaloid uh, van. It looks like they're actually playing the Project uh -huh. Diva game. This is pretty astonishing yeah. stuff. The rhythm game. Uh -huh. Project Diva. And there's like at least 12 different uh -huh. monitors inside the car. So nothing to be embarrassed about here. This is all completely normal. So let's go back over this way. Wow. Pretty impressive, pretty gorgeous. Lots of Hatsune Miku. Mm -hmm. um, there's literally just a, you know, like just, it's a, a battlefield here uh -huh. <laughs> of anime decorated cars. Uh, they got a, a, a key, a snack, a uh, key coffee Hatsune. sign outside. Looks like there's some goodies inside. So you don't need to go to the disc or anything with that. That's the fish from, uh, that's Luca's kind of mascot. Yeah. Luca Bratzi from The Godfather. But this is when I start to freeze up and lose my mind. It's uh, the top of on their eye, or the, the gunbuster vehicle. This is really great, some really old school robot anime here. Wow. Uh, decorated even on the inside mm -hmm. with uh, exciting character uh, hug pillow sheets, mm -hmm. as they're called. And it looks like we have Norco here, <laughs> the pilot of the Gunbuster. <laughs> Norco, how do you got this in us? And uh, this is probably, for me, the best in the show. If I was giving out awards, this uh, Ray from Evangelion Mobile would probably take the cake. Well, she's in, in a car. Yeah, yeah, Ray, Ayanami Ray herself is in the passenger seat of this vehicle. It's kind of like a deco truck, only like a deco van. If you can see inside, it's pretty incredible. What's going on in here? Can you explain to me uh, what's happening in here exactly? I know. Hi. <laughs> Hello, is anyone home? Is this a real size? I don't know. And uh, best of all, it's got the Evangelion Pachinko machine in the back. Along with one of the pillows of Ayanami Ray laid out horizontally. <laughs> wow, wow. Uh, wow. How do you feel about this? Is this real Japanese culture? We finally found it at last. Is this what it's all about? No. <laughs> it's actually 
actually some there was some pachinko uh -huh. tokens. How much is well, spent on this all together? <laughs> uh -huh. Maybe they like won all the money off Pachinko. <laughs> uh, the cars are starting to drive around now, so mm -hmm. this is pretty thrilling. <laughs> now it's like really dangerous because we have like uh, men dressed as women, we have <laughs> high winds, a chance uh -huh. of rain, and now vehicles just uh, about to smash into us at any moment. Now you were excited about this one yeah, earlier. It's so the cute. Monster Hunter car? <laughs> What's going on here? I I'm not a Monster Hunter fan, so please, ex please explain. <laughs> I don't know well, but this is a kind of mascot character okay, okay. in Monster Hunter. And also this mirror is a character. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. It's so cute. And I think it ends here with this incredible police car. Wow. Uh, this is great. So theoretically, they'll come out and like arrest everyone at the end of the show. <laughs> Take everyone home in handcuffs. <laughs> The lamp is a real one? Uh, it, it sure looks like one, yeah. Wow. Okay, you, I would like you now mm -hmm. to check out these incredible mm. itansha? itansha, these kind of, uh, uh -huh. I guess, motorcycles. This yeah. is, I guess, Yankee style <laughs> for the Japanese uh -huh. juvenile delinquent who loves Hatsune Miku Vocaloid. Uh -huh. wow. Feel free at any moment to jump on top of one and just drive around. <laughs> wow. so we've got a real prize winner here. This is really, really an impressive piece of work here. I guess it's the anime? Yeah. Okay. God, it's just the detail in here is like really incredible. So they've taken first place before. Ah. I'd say the three biggest are like Kaon, Lucky Star, mm -hmm. and Vocaloid. Mm -hmm. Are the three, wait, which one's this? Wow, it's an Ikito-sen. Oh, was it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Ikito-sen, Dragon Destiny. Mm -hmm. That's your? That's this, yes. Really? Yay! I found my character. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being a friend. <laughs> oh, look! What's that? What's that? Oh my god, a Luca bike! <laughs> Are you responsible for this? Yeah. <laughs> Is this your idea? No. Wow! Oh, it's a Yamaha scooter. Uh-huh. Because my is from Yamaha. Yeah, it's pretty I'm cool. I'm so glad when I found my character. Luca? <laughs> Who's the best? If you were giving out prizes, would you, like, <laughs> where would it go? It's that, Luca. Luca Mobile? <laughs> okay. But it's beautiful color. Oh, wow. What anime is this from? I don't know, what is this anime? Fate? Uh, I love <laughs> it. <laughs> it's the kind of thing you want everyone to know about, so you should put it just like, Right on the side of your bike. <laughs> wow. This is the Hatsune Miku bike. Mm. For real tough guys who aren't afraid to <laughs> drive around town with anime <laughs> characters on their bicycles. Sugoi. It's like it's starting to rain a little bit, creating <laughs> havoc here in the Itach Itacheri mm -hmm. section. Cherry chari meaning bicycle. Yes. Something like the old women ride around town. <laughs> well here you go. Wow. Hatsune Miku and uh, Luka. <laughs> okay, now this is like a real showstopper uh -huh. right here. Miku again. It's a Hatsune Miku uh -huh. bicycle built for two. Uh -huh. You and me, we can ride this around. <laughs> and the paint job is like the, uh, the, the negi, negi, the uh -huh. green onion. <laughs> wow. So this is pretty impressive. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> you, you'll never believe what we found here today. Uh, check it out. We got a bunch of Vocaloid cosplayers here. Wow! Wow. Uh, who can we? There's like there's Miku, there's Luca. I'm sorry. You. This is like you are the voice of, of Luca. So you want to get in there? Check this out. Oh my goodness. 
それは質問あります。じゃあ、はい、どこから来ました、皆さん。どこから来ました？みんな東京ですか？東京です。Everyone's from Tokyo. Okay, that's cool. And why did you decide to cosplay as Vocaloids today? どうしてボーカロイドのコスプレを選んだんですか？仕事今あのステッカーを販売しておりまして、はい、こちらの方で結構ボーカロイドを主に取り扱っていますのでーはいスリングボーカルステッカーしたまえおけまに貼るステッカーねじゃあ安い安い安い,安い<笑>大好評ですへえ<笑>なるほどはいなのでみんなボーカロイドで合わせて販売普段普段はコスプレイヤーさんをされてるんですか普通に社員さんですコスプレイヤーですはいえー、あ他の方々は社員さんですかあと,<笑>あとちょっと仕事で、あのー、メイドとか、はい、千葉系の仕事をしてます Made for my camera okay. and okay. students, students. Okay. okay. <laughs> and now's the time, here's your big Mito Komon moment where you have to tell them <laughs> that you're the voice of Luca they, Yeah, I don't think they, they know No, I don't think so, you should, please, please, go ahead, go ahead Are, I'm sorry, Luca's voice I'm sorry, Luca's voice ありがとうございましたありがとうございました。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございました。Wow, check out this 11 eyes vehicle. You check it out. Um, that's pretty awesome. We've also got a really, really nice Macross Frontier one here. Uh, but that one's really nice too. Yeah, this is my character. Oh, that's your character? Oh. Okay, well, oh wow, what a great car. This is so great. Wow. I'm so sorry that I tried to shift all the attention over to this. And this is a spell. Okay. So difficult Can you make the rain stop with your magic spell, you? The weather's getting a bit rough out here. What does that mean? Please translate. She's an omyaji. Okay. Uh -huh. So okay. I have to say spell. That's some pretty serious oh. magic. Um, we've got a Kaon vehicle here. Oh, bye bye. <laughs> uh, wow, check wow. out this ride. This is pretty awesome. Check out this old school it's style roadster. One? Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Well, it looks like an old Japanese style classic roadster. Is this Japanese car? Uh, I believe it is. I believe actually it is. It's got some lovely pinstriping here. Uh -huh. uh, Hatsune wow. Miku vehicle, of course. I've never seen that car. And uh, I think it's time to uh, to hijack it. I think it's time uh -huh. to carjack. Okay. <laughs> Can so we? So I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Uh -huh. No one else, you know, minds. I'm just gonna get inside <laughs> and uh, get out of this rainy weather. All right, you <laughs> get inside.
Okay, that uh, event was fantastic. It was amazing, yes. but it started raining and we mm. had to flee for our very lives. Mm. And even now we are wet and cold and uh, it seems like the end of another episode. And indeed, mm. it's the end of season two of Otaku vs. Zero. Uh, yeah, there's no more. Sorry, uh, it was fun, but now it's done. But uh, we'll be back in season yeah. three. <laughs> But uh, it won't be easy because we need more viewers. Man, mm -hmm. do we need more viewers. And two, we need your questions and your comments and your requests to make the show that you want to see. So you can send your emails, as always, uh, to our directors and producers and our staff <laughs> of, of hundreds at, uh, what's the email address again? OVZ at KZTisha.com. And you can also hashtag us on Twitter at hashtag O-V-Z-E-R-O -E and mm -hmm. leave uh, questions and comments and we'll probably respond to you there as well. Mm -hmm. So you, while we have some time off, we're going to have a little break in between seasons. Mm -hmm. Do you have anything you'd like to plug? Is there something we should keep on the horizon uh, looking for? TV animation, Dream Angel uh, will be started on um, July. In July? July. Your new animation that act. you are a voice actress for? Yes, I will act uh, Saijo. Kind of a lady okay. teacher. And I had that TV anime you can watch by uh, Nico Nico Doga. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Okay. For free. Okay. And watch uh, it for free on Nico Nico Doga. All right. TV games of Ever 17 will be out. A new TV game. Okay. In July. So we'll check out. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we'll be back in a little bit. So uh, keep watching the old episodes. Tell your friends, tell your neighbors, grab the mm -hmm. phone book, rip out pages and start dialing the numbers <laughs> that you see there and tell them to watch the show too. In the meantime, thanks, thanks, thanks for supporting our show and we'll see you next time with season three. Bye-bye. See ya. Bye-bye. <laughs>